Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an Alta haul. They have the perfume thing going on again where you get the bag, so I end up going back twice. And if you're interested in seeing what I picked up at Alta, keep on watching. Okay friends, welcome back. Um, today is going to be an Alta haul, as you can tell by the title and the intro. And as what I have here is two bags filled with goodies. Um, the first bag, let's start with a perfume first. I, I already opened this, you guys. I was so excited. It smells so good when you walked into Alta that I just could not help myself, so I ended up going ahead and opening it. But it is God is a Woman by Ariana Grande. I love the box. It's so pretty, you guys. And on the inside, when you open it up, I thought the whole container to the perfume was actually attached, but it turns out it's not. So you guys should be very careful when you're pulling it out. Um, this is what I'm talking about. The bottle is absolutely stunning, you guys. It's so pretty. But this part, let's see if it just came off. This part here actually comes out of that part right there. So you guys have to be very careful. I didn't know that, and I went to go lift it up, and it kind of like came apart. It's like, I was glad I was over my bed when I did this, so I did not drop anything. But um, it smells really, really good, you guys. It kind of reminds me a little bit of the first uh, fragrance that she came out with. I think it was the first one. And I just ate some of the perfume because I spritzed it. But um, I think it was the one. It's like in a little round ball. It's the spritzer. Oh, God, what is the name of that one? I can't think of the name of that one, but it was like the first one she came out with. It had like a, a fuzzy keychain ball or something on it. That one smells amazing. And this one kind of reminds me of that one quite a bit. Um, the next thing that I got in here is... By Too Faced, that's my jam palette. I've seen this a couple times, you guys, and I really, really wanted to try it. And I was like, I don't know, you know, those colors won't look good on me. But I got to looking at it the other day when I was over there, and I thought it was just so cute to pass up. Look at that. It's like a little tin can. It's so cute. Um, the colors that actually caught my eyes in here is the one pink, like this one over here, and it's not even doing it justice, you guys, in there. But the pink, the purple, and that color right there is the ones that really did it for me, you guys. Look how pretty that is. It is stunning, isn't it? I mean, oh my gosh. And these little palettes, I think, were like $27. They're not very expensive, which for Too Faced is pretty dang good because they have some really good quality eyeshadows. I still have my um, pink Bum Bum palette from them, and I absolutely love that palette. That is like one of my go-tos. I use that like almost every day. And I, I'm almost out of the one. It's the white shade. I forget what they call it. But I always set my eyes with that before applying my eyeshadows. It's just like one of my favorites, you guys. If you know, you know, right? Um, the next two items I picked up was Beauty Blenders. And I got one in a soft pink and a black one. The black one is actually my daughter's. She loves this color. She's been wanting it for a while. And the pink one, you guys see, the light's kind of washing out. But it's such a pretty color. Look at that. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. And then we got the basic black one right here. I have a dark blue one. I think it came out, I know guys, no judgment, but it came out like a couple years ago and I really wanted the royal blue one. And like, I can't find the color anymore. So if you guys know where you can get like the royal blue beauty blender, let me know because I really, really want to get my hands on that one and I haven't been able to. And mine's falling apart, but I still use it. I just cleaned it the other day, you guys. I clean them all the time. Not as much as I should, but we ain't gonna talk about that, right? Um, the next uh, perfume, I went back and I got another perfume because I just can't help myself. I have a real obsession for perfumes, you guys. I think it was like three, four weeks back, I ended up picking up the, um, I wanna say Derek James, and I might be wrong about that because I can't think of it off the top of my head, but it's like 2 a.m. kiss. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. But anywho, we're getting off topic again as usual. This is called Very Good Girl by, um, Carolina um, Herrera. I don't know why I'm having a problem pronouncing that today. <laughs> Just a little off as usual. But here's what the box looks like, you guys. It is so, so pretty. Um, and I thought that this was probably going to be just a regular spray bottle because all of hers looks like high heels. But I thought because this is like a little sample one that it probably wouldn't, you guys. Are you ready for this? Look at how cute. Like, I think the original ones is like this tall. This looks a little bigger on camera than it is in real life. But I think the original ones are like this. And this one is just so tiny and I thought, mm, I'm gonna spritz it. No, this part comes off. Let me get it off you guys. I had a hard time getting it off the other day too, but this part comes off and then you just have like the little spray bottle over here. And God, I'm just gonna smell so good after today. I'm not even joking. Mm, it smells so, so good. It's kind of nice. I think this one here, in my opinion, and I could be wrong because I'm terrible at describing scents, 
this one is a little bit more I want to say floral sweet in my opinion because I know the other one has like a really like um I think the other one the first one it has like a a must musk musk smell to it and this one here is a little more feminine in my in my opinion but smells so dang good you guys so good um so the next two items is the freebies that i got for buying the perfumes and this one i seen and that's the reason i went over there and got the Ariel grande perfume because i really wanted this bag but it's just so cute it's a little backpack and it has the little detailing here i'm not sure i think these are yeah those are real pockets you guys isn't that cute so it just looks like a leather it's a faux leather and then it's a backpack so all your stuff is there and i told my daughter that we're gonna end up sharing it because i went back the second time to get the high hill perfume the catherine o'hara and they were out of this bag and we had to get stuck with another one which i'm gonna show you but that was the original bag i wanted to go back for again so if they have that at your store and it's like locally around me if you know me you know where i'm at um let me know because i really want to i'd go buy another perfume for another one of those bags they're just so cute um this is the other one we got i don't really care for this one i'm probably gonna end up giving it to my daughter but it's just basic nothing to write home about don't care for it that much the brown one i'm obsessed with um now that i hauled all this stuff i can actually put it away and i'm really stoked to be using this palette oh my gosh i'm gonna be doing a look with it tomorrow um so yeah i know it's a short sweet haul but that is all you guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you're not yet subscribed please do so give likes up and thank you guys for watching and until next time bye